Explorers Between the Lines. Three, two, one, go. We're in qualification match 50 on Planet Primus. All three Blue Lines robots in action. Bionic Bombers have a hatch panel and they're just able to save themselves from tipping over. Red Alliance side of the field, Laser Robotics quickly grabbing a hatch panel. Their alliance partners, Tech Fusion, trying to do the same. Meanwhile, the Blue Alliance, the Ravonics Revolution, quickly scoring two cargo into the Blue Alliance cargo ship. Very efficient. While Droid Rage, excuse me, Robo Riot on the Blue Alliance is playing some hard defense on the Red Alliance side of the field. Looks like they may have sustained some damage. We'll see what the Blue Lions can do. They do have a lead right now, 34 to 11. Walnuts and Bolts on the Red Alliance. Trying to get something going while their Alliance partners, Laser Robotics, add some cargo in the cargo ship. On the Blue Alliance side of the field, some additional cargo being scored. That was by Bionic Bombers. And the Blue Alliance rocket is being scored. 1710, that's the Ravonics Revolution. Looks like they're adding some hatch panels to that as well. Still anybody's game. We've got less than 60 seconds left in this match. Blue Alliance leads it 44 to 22. Bionic Bombers looking to add to that lead, except they added additional cargo into an already scored cargo bay. You can only score three points from a single cargo in a cargo bay. Red Alliance, we've got Laser Robotics placing another cargo for the Red Alliance side. As we're going down to 25 seconds. Let's see if Tech Fusion's ramp bot will be successful. They've got less than 15 seconds and Laser is continuing to climb, and it looks like they will be successful. 10 seconds left, we've got one Blue Alliance on the level one platform, as Bionic Bombers joins them in the final seconds of this match. They win it with a score of 61 to 46. But the Red Alliance did manage to pull out a ranking point thanks to that hab climb.